Okay, cool. We got the Varrock piece. I don't even know what it looks like. What the fuck is that, dude? Come on. Hey, people, what's up? Welcome back to another RuneScape video. And uh, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to open my videos like that because it just sounds cliche. I feel like everybody does that, and I don't want to do that shit. All right, anyways. I got some stuff to turn in, and I gotta do it before the reset, because I always forget to turn in my challenges, and I never get the experience, or the reward, or whatever you want to call it. So let's do this right now. It was Rampage something something. Rampage MKX, I have no idea what that means. I hope this gives me a lot of XP. Let's do it on uh, summoning, because, oh yeah, actually I can't. I guess we can do it on HP, so that one takes a little bit longer than, than any of the other ones. And wow, it gives us 12 fucking K. That's awesome. Fucking awesome. All right, anyways, what I was doing before I logged out yesterday was do the Varrock tasks because I said I was going to do them after I finished the Lumbridge easy ones. So I did a few. I didn't record it because it was kind of late. And I'm like, fuck it. I'm just going to do it right now. But I ended up falling asleep. So you get to watch it. Okay, I think the one I left off was I had to buy some newspaper thing. That's not the right one. Let's see. Varrock. Uh, read all about it. Buy a copy of the Varrock Herald. Okay, let's go to Varrock and buy the newspaper copy, which is in the middle of the town, or the city. I didn't know... I forgot about the teleport that you get with your uh, legendary pet, so that's fucking awesome. Just a quick heads up, if you see the game is sort of lagging or stutter a little bit, it's because I have V-Sync, and uh, it's, it, it's so that I can keep my FPS at 60, because I usually get like over 100, and uh, I'm recording. So I don't want to give too much load on my GPU and CPU. So that's why I have to keep it on. Uh, if it bothers you, just let me know and I'll turn it off. Because I guess I could do it the other way because I used to. But I don't want to toll my computer too much. How the hell do I buy a newspaper? 50 gold pieces. That's pretty expensive for a newspaper. Anybody who lives in Varrock can afford a 50 coin newspaper. That's fucking crazy. Read all about it. You've completed the task. Okay, next one. What's the next one? Pot stop, make a bowl on a potter's wheel, then fire in the pottery oven. All in Barbarian Village. So make a bowl in a potter's wheel. Okay, we gotta head over to Barbarian Village. That's where all the good stuff is at. The crafting good stuff. Why Varrock doesn't have its own pottery wheel, I have no idea. But it's a whatevs. It's a whatevs. Okay, let's make the pot. Wait, was it, was it a pot? I gotta make sure. I don't want to do that shit again. Make a bowl. It's a bowl, see? I was gonna screw that up. Where's the bowl? Okay. Now, time to put it in the oven. Awesome. Pot stop completed. Next one. It belongs in a museum. Speak to Haig Helen after obtaining at least 50 kudos. 50 kudos. I think I've done that already, actually. I remember doing the, the little museum test when you go down the steps. So hopefully I'm right, because that was a pain, going all around those stupid little exhibits and answering questions, which I completely bullshitted on. That's how I got through high school. Okay, where is Helen Hager, whatever his fucking name is. Hague Helen, okay. We have 38 kudos. Okay, we're missing a few kudos. How the hell do you get kudos? All right, if you speak to this guy, if we've done certain quests, he can give us some kudos. So hopefully we've done some new quests. Uh, that he has not listened to from us yet. Uh, let's see. Uh, I've helped save some gnomes. Okay, you gonna give me some stuff for that? The mage has let me in a secret to the rune crafting. Wait, I haven't came here and told him about that? That's such a noob quest. I can't tell you much, but I do know that rune essence can be mined from a secret place. Then, using the altars and talismans, I can change it into runes. That's pretty cool. I'll get a display up immediately. Display number 21, the first display of the fifth age. That's cool. How many kudos do I have now? 48 kudos. Okay, we need two more. Two more and we'll be good. All right, I'm reading this off the wiki. By completing the Damarok statue for the first time, 10 kudos. I think I can do that because I have all the statue pieces in my bank. But it's my personal collection. I don't want to fucking get rid of it. Look, check this out. I cleaned my bank, by the way. Much, much cleaner. Kinda, sorta, not really. Here's my rock collection. I fucking love these rocks. I love them all. I don't want to get rid of them, so... 
If we can find something else that'll give us kudos, that'll be great. Actually, it says here for the first time. So can we do that multiple times? Because, I mean, I, if I can use them and get kudos and then just get the collection again, that'd be fucking awesome. You know what? We're going to do it. That'll open up a free tab as well. I've been having them forever. For literally, probably a year since I've started playing on this account. It's been more than a year. Okay, I think that's all of them. Hopefully that should be enough to complete the statue. If it's not, I'm going to be a little pissed because I wouldn't have used it if I knew I didn't have all the pieces. You leave that plinth alone. It's for a statue of Serdoman. We're going to build. Okay, that's not where I'm supposed to put this stuff. Uh, okay, cool. I spoke to this guy, Marius Giste, if that's not even how you pronounce his name. He told us we can put the statue here, where the statue of Serdoman was supposed to go. But fuck Serdoman. It's all about Zeros, you know? And I think we have all the pieces. Oh, I'm getting XP in, in this stuff. 3k, 4k, 4k, 2k, 2k, 1k, 4k, 3k, 2k. That's it. Did I finish the statue? Statue of Damrock. Skills I've already added parts from. Parts I've get to add I can get from. Hunter. Really? I haven't gotten Hunter Rocks? Are you serious? I'm fucking level 41 Hunter. I have never gotten a single goddamn rock from Hunter. Great, now we did that for no freaking reason. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. Okay, we gotta figure out what else to do now. You know what, we're just gonna have to find stuff. We're gonna have to find stuff here in the dig site area. And hopefully we get at least one or two. We need two, so. I think I need stuff here though. I need a specimen brush. Okay, how do I do this? How do I use it on, uh... Do I just use it on the table and then I find stuff? Okay, I didn't know, I forgot how this works. Okay, I think we found something. This looks pretty cool. Five coins? Are you fucking joking? And he didn't even give me kudos. What the hell? That's major bullshit. Okay, so I just read in the wiki all the stuff I can find by going through this dig specimen stuff. And uh, all the stuff I found are over here. So I found the mace, the uh, arrowheads, that ancient symbol thing, some weird tombstone over there, uh, some bowls, and some jewelry. I have this thing, ancient coin, which I don't see over here. So maybe this thing will give us some kudos. Okay, cool. That was something. And uh, according to the wiki, we get 10 kudos for placing the thing. There we go. Okay, that gave us 10 kudos. We should be good now. Okay, let's finish the, the stupid Varrock tasks. Oh, that's it. You completed it. It belongs in the museum. Awesome. Next one. Journey to the center of the earth altar. Enter the earth altar using an earth tiara or talisman. Okay, let's go do that. Let's drop this stuff though, because I don't want it. Uh, the talisman pulls you towards the northeast. This is the northeast, in fact, so let's use it on the mysterious ruin. And go in there. I haven't done this in a long time. I haven't used a talisman in a mysterious rune since like forever. There we go. Journey to the center of the earth. Altar. Have Elsie tell you a story. Jack and Nar. Jack and Nuri? Jack. Jack Connery? Jack. Jack. I don't know how to fucking say that, man. Damn it. Okay, we have two left for the easy ones. Mine some limestone near Pater. 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 Pater Damas? Dude, I'm so fucking stupid. Well, things just got super creepy. I love going through this area because you get happy music and all of a sudden it turns eerie and fucking scary and green, which makes things even more scary. Limey. There you go. Let's get out of here before it eats us. Last but not least, king of the castle, fight the highest, find the highest point in Varrock, which is obviously the fucking castle. So let's go over there. Okay. These stairs should lead us to the top and we should be done. Got to get to the highest point. I remember this spot. I used to train there when I was a noob in my main account back in the old days. There we go. Congratulations. Oh no, I didn't read it. King of the castle. Completed. Who do I speak to now? Speak to Rat Burgess to claim your reward. Who the fuck is Rat Burgess? Is that the creepy guy over by the Paterdamas? There he is. I was going to go over to Paterdamas, but it, I read on the wiki that's not the guy. Okay, cool. We got the Varrock piece. I don't even know what it looks like. What the fuck is that, dude? Come on. Well, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.